I'm gonna show you how to quickly install presets on Lightroom Mobile. It's very easy, very simple, but there is a couple of key steps that you need to follow. So watch this video all the way through. I promise you, once you do it once, you could do it over and over and over again very, very quickly, but you need to follow the steps. So before I get into the phone here and show you exactly how it's done on the phone, uh, you need to download your presets. And I think the best way to do that is to download them onto your computer and put them up on a Google Drive or a Dropbox or something like that. That way you could transfer the files over to your phone. You could use an application on your phone like WinZip or WinRare or any other program that could unzip the files, but the easier way to do it is to do it on a laptop or a computer where you could unzip, put it up on a Google Drive or a Dropbox, and then transfer it over to your phone. Either way, step one is unzipping the files and getting them ready to import into Lightroom. So let's do that first. So I downloaded my presets into a download folder on my Google Drive. What I want to do is unzip, and then extract it to a folder. Now inside that folder, we have the desktop XMP and the mobile DNG. The mobile DNG files are the ones that you want to install on your phone. This is what they look like. So that's step one, very easy, just unzipping the files into a location you get access from your phone. So step two here is going to be importing the files from your phone into Adobe Lightroom Mobile. Let's go ahead and hop on in and do that. So the first thing you're going to do is open up that folder you just unzipped, go to mobile DNG. All your files are going to be here, so you're going to select all of them and download them. Now you're going to open up Lightroom Mobile. I'm going to create a new album. I'm going to call this album Wildlands Presets. I'm going to go to that album. So now I want to add files from my device. Let's add 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. These are the 11 files that I downloaded. Let's add them into the album. So now all your files are imported. You're going to open up each one and you're going to create a preset. Hit the three dots in the top right corner. Hit Create Preset. I'm going to name this Wildlands 1. And we're right here where it says Preset Groups, go ahead and tap that and make a new group. New Preset Group. I'm going to name this Wildlands Presets. Good, that's your first one. Swipe and do it for each of these 11 presets. You'll see that the preset group remains the same as Wildland Presets, so you just keep on going. After you do that first one, it becomes really easy. This is Wildlands 11. So all 11 presets are in the preset group Wildlands presets. So now all your presets have been created. Your next step is now opening whatever photo you want to edit. Let's open this one. And here's a really important part of this. When you open up your presets tab in the bottom, I'm gonna to go to Wildlands presets, tap these three dots in the corner here. Make sure that Show Partially Compatible Presets is checked. If it's not checked and using a different camera or a different type of uh, RAW file, those presets aren't going to show up or you're not going to be able to use them. So make sure that's turned on. It should be blue with a blue check mark right next to it. Now what you're going to do is you're going to tap each one of these presets and it will change your photo with those preset settings. If you find one that you like, you can make small adjustments just to fit your picture. I'm gonna raise the exposure by about a half a stop here. And there you go. See, it's not that hard. But just to recap, what you're gonna do is download the file, unzip the file either on your phone or on a Dropbox or a Google Drive, import the DNG files into Lightroom Mobile, create a preset based on those DNG files, and then apply that preset to your photos. Five easy steps and you're done installing your mobile presets. If you have any questions or you run into any trouble while importing or using your presets, feel free to leave a comment below or you could reach out to me directly on my Instagram. That's at dom.iwc. I'll leave a link for my Instagram below. I make sure to answer every single message I'm sent. So don't be shy in reaching out. I'll help you out. If you want to get a copy of my Wildlands presets, you can get them on my website, which I'll leave in the link below as well. I use these presets for each and every one of my photos as either a starting point or as just a one click and done. I put a lot of work into these presets. That's why I'm really happy to share them with you. Thanks so much for watching the video. I hope it helped you out and I will see you on the next one.